Catherine Lofgren may not speak with words, but the soon-to-be four-year-old has brought a new perspective on life and love to her family and everyone she meets. Since birth, Catherine has struggled with numerous medical conditions, from seizures to profound cerebral palsy. The 24-hour care she requires has been a financial hardship for her parents, Chris and Dan Lofgren of Gein. Hundreds of people had the chance to meet Catherine during a spaghetti fundraiser held January 29th at the Northwood School in Cook. The benefit was set up to help the Lofgren family with extensive medical and travel expenses regarding her constant care. A group of people from Cook and Virginia got together to put this fundraiser together for the Lofgren family. And so many of us feel that Chris and Dan have done so much for all of Northeastern Minnesota, for children and families through their jobs at Range Mental Health Center. And we know, knew the struggles that they were having and we really wanted to help them both emotionally and financially. Catherine has given so much joy to her family. Though she may never walk or talk, she consistently touches the hearts of others with her sweet spirit. Sunday's benefit was a way for Catherine to do just that. It means that we get to connect with a whole lot of people. That was the one thing when we started this, that we just wanted to make as many connections and have people connect with each other. And, and that was the main goal when we started. Otherwise, I don't know if we would have jumped in with both feet, but we decided to. And, well, this is great. Catherine's out there getting everybody connected and, and having them enjoy I the process. I cannot believe this. Um, when we pulled up, I said, oh, I'm sure there's something else going on at the school today. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't made it down the hallway. Yeah, it's hard um, to move three feet because you, people want to talk to you and yeah. say hi, and, and that's what we're here for. More than 800 people attended the fundraiser, which included a silent auction, raffles and drawings, a bake sale, photo booth, and face painting. Organizers say the benefit raised at least $18,000. We know that we've really rallied to help them this day, and we're really excited at how the event has turned out today. There have been several hundred people who have come through, and we just thank everybody who was a part of it. She has had a completely different affect since it started. Yeah, you and can tell right now. She... <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. Is it true? She's going to get her two cents in. <laughs> Is it true? Did you just say hi to everybody? Yes. Yeah. Good work. <laughs> It's, it's unbelievable, and the people here today. This is Angie Reby reporting for the Misabi Daily News.